So you got 20 in how many days? Two days. I think what helped it was my offer. It wasn't just about come to my trips. It was, I have a question about the YouTube. To me, I was thinking my audience want to see Ghana. I remember you were saying start now. In my head, I was like, I need to be in Ghana. What are your thoughts? You okay. don't have to be at the Super Bowl to have a YouTube channel about the Super Bowl. This was great timing with the memberships. Now I can hold them to the memberships and then address their concerns. And it has been working. I love that method that you did. The next step you can take to monetize is I am the founder of Ghana Girls Trips. We host annual group trips for women in the diaspora who want to connect with their African ancestry or the African roots. And so I've been doing it since 2020, but I realized that right now, for instance, I have a trip coming up in May. 92 people have it in your carts. A few people have bought it, but I have 92 people just waiting to buy mm -hmm. it. So I realized that some people, one, may have questions, two, they, they may need to be motivated. They're just, I don't know why they're waiting. And so I wanted to get the opportunity to ask them why they're waiting, what's going on. This was great timing with the memberships. Now I can pull them to the memberships and then address their concerns. And it has been working, actually. I love that. So you got 20 in how many days? Two days. <laughs> 20 members in two days. Yeah. 30 people signed up for my newsletter. So oh. I went out to 30 people that, hey, I have this free membership. And the way that I, I think what helped it was my offer for the membership, because it wasn't just about come to my trips. It was, if you're interested in Ghana's culture and you want to visit one day, come join and learn how to process words. Whether you come with me or on your own, you're going to learn something. So I immediately put guides on there, how to apply for your visa, how to, uh, the vaccinations needed. I put it, all of that there. I recorded, I wasn't ready camera, but I was like, I can re-record re another time if needed, but right now I just need to get to the people. And so I put everything there and then they just started coming. That's incredible. Two thirds of your mailing list signed up for your free membership in two days. Yes. That's incredible. I love that method that you did, that strategy you had. Let me give them all the value in the world right out the gate. And whether they work with me or not, they get that value. And then some of them are going to say, I want to come on that trip with you because you're helping me put it together. You make it easy for me. Yes. Yes. And so what's the plan going forward? Are you going to offer the next trip or yeah. have you already done that? So the trip is still open for booking. And so I'm still advertising and waiting for people to book. My new strategy is I've been going to Facebook groups, travel groups, and I reached out to the admins to see if they'll be open to me talking about what I do because they build their own platform. So I don't want to be disrespectful. Sure. One admin, she has about 500K followers. Wow prove that I'll be able, I should be able to do that. So I'll be posting that in there as well. And then hopefully I can get some more members in there. That's great. You know, have you started doing calls? I mean, you just started, but are you going to do calls with people? As far as people that are interested or just- Oh yeah. Inside your free membership, the next step you can take to monetize is to get people on an information call. You can say, we have this trip coming up. Okay. I did put on the calendar information session for Sunday. Nobody has yeah. signed. I did. Yeah. So this is different than that. So what you're doing with that is like a webinar or like a, a group call. What you do is you have the 20 people, maybe it's going to be 30 tomorrow. You know, you have the people and you do the, what you're doing on Facebook. You're bringing that traffic in from different places, getting them into the free membership, giving them that value. Then what you could do is do a post. You can do a okay. post and in the classroom, have a section that says info call or some sort of call, name that you give it that okay. gives them 30 minutes with you. Okay. You jump on a call. You could say something like, are you ready to take your trip? But you have a couple of questions you want to ask. Jump on a call with you, answer their questions, and then say, our next trip is here. This is the trip we're going on. Tell them a little bit about it. You just ask them, do you want to learn a little bit about the trip after you talk to them? Or you can tell them at the top of the call, hey, this call, what we're going to do is I'm going to learn a little bit about your questions and I'll try to help you with those answers. And then I'll tell you about the next trip we're taking because it's a small group and I'll tell you about it if you want to. So then everybody knows what's going on. You're doing that. And that's the key. This is the key part. 
now that you have people in your membership, you can now speak with them one-on-one and you can get conversions there of people instead of people who are sort of on the fence or don't really understand it all or Mm -hmm. feeling a little scared to take that leap. Mm -hmm. You have one-on-ones with them help them. They see that value. And some of them will say, okay, I want to go on the trip. Okay. I have a question about the YouTube. So I am going to start a YouTube, but to me, I was thinking my audience want to see Ghana and want Mm. to see in Ghana and right now I'm not, I'm here. So I remember you were saying start now in my head. I was like, I need to be in Ghana. What are your thoughts? You could have a Super Bowl YouTube channel in August because you're going to tell people and Super Bowl is in February. Right. Because you're going to tell people, you're going to get them prepared. You don't have to be at the Super Bowl to have a YouTube channel about the Super Bowl. Okay. So yours can be about Ghana. You're not there yet. Okay. I go there X number of times per year. The next time I'm going is in this, you know, you don't want to give too much information, but it's in the fall, it's in the winter, it's in the spring. And I want to tell you three things you may not know about Ghana. And then you list those things. Okay. And it's beautiful. And if you teach yourself how to edit, or if you hire an editor, you don't have to do either of these, but if you want to do that, they can use B-roll of Ghana when you're talking about it. Okay. Yeah. And then when you're in Ghana, get as much footage as you possibly can to bring back to repurpose in various videos. You can start now. And in fact, I recommend it because you're warming up that audience because you're giving them a little bit of like, oh, I want to see it. Like I personally, I want to see it. I want, oh, I can't wait. Would you love to, would you like to go to Ghana? Well, we'll talk about it. (laughs) But you see what I'm saying? Like, it's that curiosity that you're able to create. And you can see with those 20 of 30 members of your email list, how great that is. I also recommend joining listbuilder.pro. Costs just $9 a month or $50 a year. Helps you go from zero to a thousand email subscribers in 90 days. You plug it in and you do the work and it helps you. So you're going to have these different sources. I recommend send people from your YouTube to your membership and to your email and see which oh. one converts better. Send okay. people from Facebook to email or membership, see which one converts better. Okay. On your email list, then send people who are not already, you know, so you send them to your membership. And then inside the membership, keep doing what you're doing, giving that value, having those call. You can have those group calls. The real play is in those group calls say, I'm having a call with three people this week to talk about the trip. Okay. You see what I'm saying? You're going to make this something that's very special that they get to sign up for. You have them have those conversations. Some people are not going to convert. Right. But some people will. And okay. you're going to learn how many people that needs to be for it to be worth your while. And you're going to learn how to convert better and better and better over time, the more you do it. Okay. Okay. So one more thing I want to ask you before we go, what do you think the number one reason people joined your membership? If you want to help other people get members to their free memberships, what is that thing that they need to know? For me, it was, what do the people need? They're Mm -hmm. actually, not what they, what I think they need, what they actually need. And then put that in the messaging and not make it all about, your product because they're going to learn about the product so it's more like think of it as a marketplace where they're coming I guess I in Ghana I have a this where you go let's you go to the mall they're in the mall they're going to shop they want to go to Ghana one day and it's very niche and Mm. so making sure it's niche and then seeing what they need and providing what they need to them and then eventually you can convert them yes Well, thank you so much. Thank you. And here's to making the 30 day challenge, getting to your 30 members. And thank you. This is going to help a lot of people. I really appreciate it. My pleasure. Thank you.